into this uh, forecast. It's going to be a little warmer today by about 10 degrees. In fact, that's the main thing by the afternoon. It's quite different from yesterday, but yesterday kind of stood out. We had a strong onshore breeze yesterday. That's completely gone today. It's more of an offshore wind which dries us out, but also warms us up. So if we take a look at the current numbers out there, it's already warmer to start this day. It's mid 40s at our coldest right now. In fact, upper 40s, Santa Rosa 48, Livermore 47, uh, Oakland and Co Oakland's our coldest number 45 along with Concord. So that's good. W those numbers could be easily 10 degrees colder than that. We've been through the last several months like that. Here's why today's so much warmer. Watch the winds light the screen up as we go through the late morning right there. That. That's our offshore wind. Yesterday, that wind was rushing onshore and it was bringing in cool air and the humidity. And so with our offshore wind today, the temperatures start to jump. And that means in the South Bay, we're going up to the mid and upper 70s. Campbell 78, Sunnyvale 76. It'll be 76 for the daytime high in Fremont and Milpitas. We check out the numbers for the inland valleys of the East Bay. It's mid 80s. You were in the low 70s over here yesterday. So we're already about 10 degrees warmer over here. Back in the Bay, the temperatures are more in line with low to mid 70s, 75 in Kenfield and Novato. But it'll be 80 in Santa Rosa today, 82 in Sonoma, Rohnert Park, you'll be on the verge of 80. And Windsor's going to 83. There's Ukiah, mid to upper 70s up north. So tomorrow's warmer than this. Tomorrow's the warmest day in the whole seven day forecast. We're gonna be near 90 for some of our warmest inland spots. And then starting Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, the systems in the Pacific start coming back our way. And this next one, we can bring it ahead to right here, that southern edge of it, if we put it into the long range forecast and bring that on shore. Those systems start to fall apart as they come on shore. But by Friday into Saturday, you can see how close we are. We don't get rain from this, but we are gonna get breezy and we're gonna get cooler. And you see that right away in the seven day forecast. Shows up to best in San Jose, 85 tomorrow on Wednesday after today's 79. But by Saturday and Sunday, we're all the way back down to 70. Same story for the microclimates, near 90 tomorrow. And then it's mid 70s by the weekend and breezy.